Ciao, lovelies. It's Lunaria here. Still very much excited about the stuff that I got today while I was out. And I am here to show you. I went to the Goodwill outlet, which you dig through bins to find stuff. It's well worth your time. Um, you will find great stuff. It is inexpensive. It is so worth your time, dude. It is so worth your time. Okay, so this first thing that I found, I'm gonna have to eat lunch after I do all this. <laughs> it's like two o'clock and I still have it. Um, the first thing I found, I found the little Woodsy's General Store. Beep. Amazing, right? It has all the little shelves and everything. He needs a little clean, but I mean, gosh darn, it doesn't have everything that's been in you know, storage or whatever for a while. He's just a little dusty. But yeah, now I have a little general store. Um, pretty good, pretty good size. Um, so I'll be using that one for some, definitely some skits and stuff. This next thing I am so freaking excited about. I know that sounds a little bit weird, but I, Oh, it's the hinge. I thought it was like a weird sound that it made when it opened and I was like, we need to stop doing that. I got the Peppa Pig um, learning school, their, their learning play group that they go to. This, and it closes and everything. He needs a wash as well. But again, I got a Peppa Pig house and I didn't even pay like a dollar for it really because again, you'll see. But, and then this is the last play set I got. If you guys recognize this, it's a Shopkins house. Um, it's a real old Shopkins house too. But this is going to be perfect for me. And I can only explain it as I'm gonna be doing more toy videos because I always wanted to do toy content, but I never knew if like, I don't know. I never knew if I could. I had all this stigma on me being an adult. Um, and now I just don't care about the stigma, so I'm gonna film my content and I'm gonna be happy about it and everyone else can F off. Cool, all right. <laughs> all right, so a few things before I dive headfirst. Um, this is just a random little ink pad I got for the bestie. Hopefully it works. Um, I don't know. I just wanted to see it because he's making his own stamps and so I wanted to supportively be involved. This looks like a floor mat with the, um, not like a mat, it's like thin, but it looked like a thing that I could lay out and have little roads. And I was just telling CG yesterday that I desperately wanted one of these. <gasps> yes! Look at that! Guys, this is stellar. I'm so excited. And that was still in its bag, too, so like, yeah. Uh, for me, for the kitchen and for my small time, just one thing. I got myself a Disney Princess plate. I thought it was really pretty, so I was like, I want to get this Ooh, pretty. Um, this book, I'm not keeping it. It is from 19, hold on. Oh, where is it? 1979. So I'm going to give this to Bestie's mom, because Bestie's mom uh, looks for older, children's books and I've not seen one of those so maybe she doesn't have it who knows I got this cute little sign for me and CG's room that says thank you Mario your but your princess is in another castle and it's him with toad and then on the back side it says thank you Mario your quest is over we'll present you with a new quest we'll press button B to select a world I thought this would be cute um, CG and I both like Mario stuff so that'd be nice uh, set for wise I finally have my own beanie baby. I used to have these a lot as kids. I don't have any of my ones that I have as a kid anymore though. But I wanted something tiny plush related that had beans in it. That. <laughs> beans. Because I wanted a little palm friend to just sit on my palm with my hand sometimes and vibe. And that's what he is. All right, this is. We're gonna have to keep doing this because this is gonna be a this is gonna be a long thing, okay? I got this mainly because it's gonna help me store some stuff, and I desperately now need more storage. So, woo! I found a dress-up crown that I thought was pretty cute. Um, I don't know. Some of the stuff isn't for me. Some of the stuff is for my nieces and my niece and my nephews. Um, so I thought that'd be cute. Um, of course, after I clean it and you know all that good stuff. Um, some of this though is gonna be for the Etsy shop slash my booth. So 
for the Etsy shop, the reason that some of the stuff is for the Etsy shop is because some of it's going to be made into jewelry. And then some of it is going to be refurbished. But I'm trying to pull out all the stuff that I grabbed to make jewelry with. So that, there's some stuff in here that's undecided too, so it's kind of hard to tell what I was thinking of each thing, but I do kind of remember. So, in terms of just random finds that aren't like minis, that I thought were cute and I grabbed because I had never seen them anywhere else. Um, that or I just honestly really thought they were cute and I wanted them for, if not my own devices, then hopefully to find somebody who will love them. Okay, so this is the first thing I grabbed. It's one of those things that has like the little shaky balls in it. I'm gonna clean it up and use it as either like, I may clean it up and customize it and sell it in the Etsy shop as a rattle, but I think I'm gonna probably be aiming more to make it into like jewelry or some kind of further thing. Like it's not gonna be by itself, I don't think. Another rattle. Um, this is one of those things that you're supposed to clip onto the baby mobiles and stuff, but I'm gonna use this in some form of jewelry or something for the for the Etsy shop because I thought it was cute. I have no clue. I just thought this was adorable. But it's very loud. It's very loud. I got a wooden rattle. I got a wooden rattle. This one. I just liked it. I like rattles. Um weird. I didn't think I would be like that, but I do. I found this. I have no effing clue what this is. Probably some used to be some kind of teething thing that rattles, but I'm going to turn it into a necklace once I can sanitize it because I think that would be cute. Um, these I grabbed because honestly they're just really cute. They were little, little toy teacups that have bears on them that say sweet home. Guess what I found? You guys are going to flip. I flipped because I was like, this is OG. This is legit. You guys remember when Build-A-Bear used to have the little brushes and you would just, am I weird for remembering that? No? I don't know. This isn't exactly what I remember. Maybe it's a little bit after my time, but I thought it was so cute, you know? A toy wrench because, again, either going to become some kind of jewelry piece, maybe a custom toy, I haven't decided. And then I got another one. This one's wooden again. This one's from Carter's. I like this one. That one's my favorite rattle, I think, out of all of them. Okay. Continuing. Let me try to do furniture, I guess. There's so much stuff, guys. I don't even know where to begin. Um, I'll, let's start with the figures. So, I found this dude. I think he's supposed to be Captain Hook, but he needs help. Um, he needs cleaned and painted and fixed, because God, he's seen some stuff but I'm gonna make him into a custom figure because I'm starting some new toy skit ideas and yeah, little Batman, he's doing a bit old punch. I almost left this and then I read his collar and I couldn't because his collar says Yo Quiero Taco Bell and he's a little chihuahua and I didn't want to leave him, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, I don't know who this is in any at all, but some random, random dude figuring why he's some random fancy little man. Um, oh, that's right. I did find one Hello Kitty related thing, which I mean, it's not bad given that there was a lot of stuff. Well, actually, I, found, like, I think I found another one, but I'm not sure. But this is one of the characters from Sanrio. She's a little lamb. I found this adorable little terrier friend. He's just got the sweetest little face, you know? I found another Fisher Price queen. And then I also found a king, which was cool. Um, I found this, which I need sanitized and stuff, but this is a really squishy cane. I thought it was cute. Um, oh yeah, I found Sesame Street. I don't know Bert and Ernie. I don't know who's who, but he needs a wash and he's adorable and I thought he'd be fun. Um, I got this for song. Um, it's a little cheetah, but he, he goes boom, you know, you it, he's one of the toys that you can pull back and it winds up and then it like, yeah. But I thought Song would like it for his his uh, collection of stuff because uh, it's cheetahs and 
um, song by Cheetahs. And so I found it and I was like, it's a cheetah thing, it's songs. This is a Dollar Tree thing, but again, it was in there and I was like, why not? Um, I believe this is supposed to be Lucario, but he's a little messed up again. Some sanitizing, some repainting. These guys will look just, just good. Just back to normal, pretty much. Um, this one will remove this little bit from it because I don't really want that. Um, but yeah, I found this uh, flamingo. I thought she was pretty. Parasaurophosaurus. Takes, takes a team. In my brain, there's a whole team doing this. Spot on, oh, that's it. A little notebook that says split heart itis and it has a little hinge. I'm gonna probably turn that into a doll laptop actually. Um, this some kind of demented off brand LPS doll. Bro, I don't even know. It's MGM, so maybe it's like. Maybe it's supposed to be some other kind of thing. I don't freaking know, but I like them because I like LPSs and they can make good friends and it'll be cute. In my opinion. I got a Merida because guess who doesn't have a Merida? Me. She's kind of big, but she'll work. I found this delightful little man. I don't know what he was originally intended for, but he, he's just so cute. I couldn't help myself. I did not want to leave him by him lonesome, you know? I found this girl. She is, um, she has been partying, clearly. <laughs> I found this, this, this partying queen. She's a little drunk, but she's got the spirit. Um, a little princess, nothing too fancy, just a cool little figure. A uh, little sheep figure, Susie sheep for Peppa Pig. And that's more like a that's more of like a thing. This is for song two, um, because I don't think I've been able to find this one, and I don't think Song's been able to find this one. With the uh, with the Dollar Tree tiny figures, so I thought maybe he would like uh, crane. Um, and this is a little horse figure. I thought he was really pretty. There's a lot of good details on him, so I was like, I'm surprised he's here, but okay. Uh, Stego Stores. Um, <laughs> that was like the whole explanation. There you go. This is I think supposed to be one of the Fisher Price Little People superheroes. I just don't know which one he's supposed to be. Um, I have no clue about this little guy. Found him. He, I don't know. He reminded me a lot of my old Fisher Price dollhouse that I had when I was a child. So I was like, um, we have a Woody now. We have a sheriff. <laughs> um, again, another like demented off-brand LPS that I'm gonna fix up. I don't. I guess at some point they maybe tried to do a line of LPS that were the same. <laughs> I don't know. I'll figure it out later, I guess. But for now, I thought it was pretty freaking funny. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I thought it was hilarious. Dancers, yes. Okay, I'll do that in just a second. Anyway, um, <laughs> we're still doing figures, so let me pulling out all the little figures I found. Because yeah, there were a pretty good amount of little figures. I was, I was pleased, to say the least. I was particularly happy. Um, I got a lot of figures, I got a lot of accessories, and then I got a lot of like, I don't know, just stuff that I thought would be cute in my dollhouse or in the miniverse, you know? A lot of, like I said, a lot of like little furniture and stuff. Just bits and bobbles that I could find, you know? Just bits and bobbles. And I found the bits and bobbles that I thought were cute and picked them up. Um, I think that's all the figures, right? Yeah, okay. Alright, continuing with the figures, it's now that I've sorted them. We have Parasaurolphosaurus number two, Electric Boogaloo. We have. Ostrich or emu? A sheep that is ready to fight somebody. He is doing like dominant pose. Uh, T Rex, I think. Or Spinosaurus. Don't know, but he's cute. Diamond Trojan, maybe. <laughs> this is, I think, supposed to be a Rapunzel question mark. 
Yeah, I don't know. She needs repainted, but I thought she'd be a nice addition to our collections. This little guy, a little horse friend whose head is like moving and stuff. Another little horse friend, he's sculpted to be sniffling the ground, which is pretty cute. Um, I found this very, very cute little elephant friend. The sweet eyes just got me, you know? <laughs> found a Moana. Another very detailed little horse, surprisingly. Um, I didn't know what this was at first, and I thought I was gonna lose it. I laughed so hard that I had to like hold my breath so that I wouldn't laugh out loud. Um, <laughs> I know, I know it's a thing, but like I saw it and I was like, ah! <laughs> it was just so cute. I found a Sandy Cheeks figurine from Spongebob. She needs a good wash, they all do. Rudolph! Penguin. I do not know what this is at all. He got one wing. He's a little demented, but he's got the spirit. I don't know. He's a friend. Like, he's a cute little buddy. I thought maybe, maybe he'd be a good addition or something. I don't know. Maybe I'm weirdo. Another horse. Today was the day of the horse girls, I swear. Um, this is, I think, supposed to be a mini La La Loopsie. Another demented looking, off brand looking LPS. Another T Rex. An itty bitty small small but very heavy and very sturdy plastic baby. And no, I'm not even joking. For some reason he's like hefty. I don't get it. I don't know why. We got this little Zomba man. I believe he's the zombie from Scooby Doo. Sorry, it took me a bit. We got a little zombie bestie. He's got some articulation, which is cool. Uh, I found this. A little a little Teddy bear, thought he was cute. I found this, and this this little panda is delightful. He's very solid, first and foremost. And second of all, I can just very, very gently move his head. But his head is, but yeah, so cute. Um, penguin pirate. He was in the bottom of one of them bins, you know. Um, and then this one. Sorry, the cat food is going off. No way. Ah, uh, well, it's not furry. Oh, that's so cute. Had a little paw print stamp. I don't know what the heck this was from, but um, this is the little figure on it. He's just a little wolfie. Itty bitty small, small Peppa. <laughs> and now furniture, because there's a lot. <laughs> or like furniture, dollhouse furniture items. I found an animal jam chest. So here's the chest. See Animal Jam on the back. It opens. It's pretty, pretty rad. Mm -hmm. I found another royal bed, so that's cool. I found another throne. This is something that I like. I saw it and I was like, this was not probably intended to be a toy, but now it is. Um, it's a kitty pool but it's like a little dinosaur kitty pool. I don't know, I thought that was real cute. Maybe I'm just a weirdo, but I like really, really thought that was cute. I found a little Taj Mahal. I thought that was cool. I thought that'd be really cool for decoration for the dollhouse. Um, same also with this, I found a little mini Big Ben. This is the other doll, or this is not, this is the other Hello Kitty thing I was talking about that I found. It's a Hello Kitty school desk. I thought it was really, really, really neat. Um, a sun chair, a bit smaller than the usuals, but nevertheless. A salon slash, uh, just in general, chair. Traffic cone, boo, don't go after your brother's food, I will get mad. <laughs> as soon as I told her no, she just stopped, sat down, and stared at me. I mean it, Lokity, no. Uh, this is also just a, like a random chair. It's supposed to look like a fruit thing. I don't know. I thought it was cute. That's like their running theme, okay? Uh, they had the Play-Doh cones. They didn't have the set, which is fine. But it's just so nostalgic for me. I love these. <laughs> uh, this, which is supposed to be like a, a doll or a stuffed animal. Uh, Band-Aid, again, nostalgia. 
itty bitty small small baby keys again that's more for the etsy shop i don't know why i pulled that out before but that's gonna be an etsy, etsy thing same with this it's a little mermaid cup again another etsy thing i don't watch blippy but i liked having the the possibility for a recycling can so i was like you know what all right i found a lot of wooden vehicles and you guys know i've been into vehicles lately for some reason i don't really know what it is but yes i've been very into vehicles lately um so i found a lot of wooden cars specifically like this one like a bus this one stubby this one kind of big like an suv another suv kind of this one's like a construction vehicle i got a monster truck i got two um this one is a triceratops shaped one this one is like a t-rex head <laughs> i don't know guys it's cute all right damn sue me uh i got a stoplight it's a little wooden stoplight i thought it was adorable um i'm telling you guys if you're a toy youtuber hell even if you're not a toy youtuber even if you're just a collector visit your local goodwill outlet because y'all might be shocked anyway tiny little gas can <laughs> tiny little lawnmower another tiny little s'mores as if i didn't have enough s'mores for them yet <laughs> tiny tiny little carriage which i'm gonna do some uh decorating tm wooden piano i might take the legs completely off and just go from like go differently with it because anyway um this i do not oh it's my cat she loud all right i don't know what this is supposed to be from it's a locker i thought it was cool Another thing that again I don't really know where this is from. It's a it's a utility cart for like a garage. And then the last but not least for the Goodwill dollhouse stuff. I got me a pumpkin. In a little little bit of pumpkin. I suppose since we're already here, I will show you the other stuff I got and then we will be done with this video and you guys will be a big old sigh of relief because you'll finally be free from me and my ramblings. I got hot glue sticks because I was running out. Shocking. <laughs> I got two things of very thick craft foam because there's a lot of projects that I like to look at that include craft foam, but mine craft foam has always been too uh, too thin. So yeah, I got a set of Among Us stickers. I got these actually at Pop Show. Um, I thought these were really cute. These are for song. I thought that one really liked these. Um, and then I got a Hello Kitty sticker book as well. They had craft sticks, the jumbo ones, which I use for furniture crafting, again. These are beading needles. These are gonna make making jewelry for the shop really easy, which is nice. Um, and the last thing I got, which, again, another sale find. You guys know I'm not fond of buying things full price. I don't typically enjoy that at all. Um, so another sale find. This was three dollars. Um, and it has wood, like lighter wood, brick, grass, and sky. These are backgrounds. So yeah, I'm gonna be really, really doing some stuff. So I'm really excited and everything, I don't know, it's, it's really exciting. Everything's really gonna be cool. Um, really looking forward to it. Thank you lovely so much for watching. Um, I'm sorry this video was like hella long, but thank you lovely so much for watching. Please remember to like this video if you liked it, comment below anything else you'd like to say, and I will see you lovelies next time. So please remember to stay awesome and love yourself, and I'll see you guys uh, next time. So, bye lovelies.